Hi, this is Tira Mitchell from Engraver.com and today I want to show you our camera mount for the Leica A60 microscope and how to assemble it. Each kit comes with an instruction sheet and these parts. We have a rubber sleeve, a steel clamp, a double ball clamp for the camera holding, a plastic mount base. You have to have your own camcorder and two bolts and two nuts. Tools that are very helpful in putting this together are a regular screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, and a 5 16 socket wrench is very helpful. Another tool that helps in the assembly is a pair of needle nose pliers. The first step is to disassemble this double mount assembly. Unscrew that, but not all the way, and the ball joint comes right out. Put the ball joint on the plastic base and secure it with the bolts and the nuts. They fit right through and you can get them hand started. To tighten this down Use a Phillips screwdriver and I like to hold the back with needle nose pliers so that the bolt doesn't move on me. Once the two of these parts are together, we need to add the steel clamp. To do this, it usually comes somewhat threaded. Open the steel clamp with the screw and we need to take the rubber sleeve and put it over the steel clamp here. This will protect your microscope or anything that you will secure this clamp around from scratching. Now to fit this assembly into the base, there's two sides. One has a large hole, the other has a somewhat small hole. So the screw part goes into the large hole, the rest of the steel mount goes through the other. and they meet here in the back. While holding those together, you can start to screw in and that will start the steel clamp threading through to lock. Once you have this part ready, you can add the remainder of the double ball Again, it should be open from when we took this part out. You can put it in there. Screw it closed. And the entire assembly is now ready to go. Once you have this assembly together, you can use it with any camera that uses a standard tripod mount. For this and other cool tools, please visit us at engraver.com.